Hello, Mr. Richard here to talk to you about what it means to be a vegetarian. Okay, now I get this question quite often. Um, say, hey, uh, I know you teach health. Um, I'm thinking about becoming a vegetarian or I know someone who is a vegetarian. Is it healthy? The answer is yes. It can be. So what is vegetarian? Now, vegetarian is someone who simply just eats only vegetables and no meat. Okay, so I just picked a few things from um, my pantry and fridge. Uh, obviously, if it's a vegetable, you can eat it, hence the term vegetarian. So um, we've got hummus, which is garbanzo beans, by the way. That's what hummus is. Okay, or chickpeas, same thing. Um, baby bella mushrooms, um, more black beans, spinach. Now, just because it's vegetarian doesn't mean that it's necessarily always healthy because you can eat unhealthy and be a vegetarian at the same time, which means uh, you can eat coconut macaroons, which is uh, anything coconut. I I love coconut, so anything coconut is delicious for me. Um, you can eat French fries if you're a vegetarian. There's all kinds of foods you can eat that would be unhealthy, even though it's still a vegetarian option. But typically speaking, when you talk vegetarian, you're talking about healthy foods because it's Mostly vegetables and fruit, okay? So you can eat fruit if you're vegetarian. Um, not so good as well as protein. You always wonder, how can I get enough protein in if I'm a vegetarian? Because meat typically has a lot of protein in it. And if you're not eating meat, then what things have protein in it? Well, we've gone over this before, but if you're vegetarian, um, you get to eat a lot of nuts, a lot of beans, um, and uh, potentially a lot of um, yogurts and milk and stuff. But there's even protein in the spinach. So... Uh, you can get protein from all different sources. Um, you can even get protein if you uh, if you're vegetarian from sources like okay, uh, there's June bug here. So you eat a June bug. Pretty good June bug, but um, June bugs have a good source of protein as well. Um, if you can get past the crunch part. The day I've eaten eating a bug, not so awesome, but tastes pretty good. I'm just kidding. I wouldn't eat a June bug. That's just a date. <laughs> gotcha. I do love dates, but if you do it quick enough, it looks like a June bug. Just kidding. Um, I do love dates. Vegetarian option. Now, what is not vegetarian? Obviously, this is bacon. Um, here's some more uh, meat. Uh, it's pretty delicious as well. Now, what about um, fish? Now, a true vegetarian is not going to be eating fish. But I do know some vegetarians that do eat fish. Just a choice that they make. Um... Fish is very healthy for you, but a true vegetarian is not going to be eating fish either. So, uh, I have never actually gone vegetarian before. I've um, I've always eaten meat, um, pretty much because I like things like um, bacon and um, some good Italian meat and some fish. Um, but I I do really enjoy some vegetarian meals. I could, I think I'm, I haven't, I've actually gone vegetarian for a week or two just to see what it's like. Very doable. I can do it. I could probably do it for uh, a really extended amount of time. I've just never tried. Um, I, why? Because I just, I like meat and it's usually available, available in some source or another. And I don't like turning down food. I like to taste all kinds of foods. So um, go ahead. If you want to be a vegetarian, go ahead. It's, it's healthy for you. Um, you can be just as healthy, if not more healthy, being a vegetarian than, uh, um, than not in, in, eating pretty much all foods. But uh, you can also be vegetarian and be unhealthy about the same thing. So either way, eat the healthier foods if you're a vegetarian. You're going to have to eat more foods with protein in it, but very doable. Something that uh, is interested me and I, I would go a fair amount of time being a vegetarian. But I do like meat. So either way, healthy for you. Enjoy. And uh, don't eat June bugs. Just kidding.
but dates are delicious. Adios.